Media West Realty presents Magnolia Park News. Your source for local events, real estate information, and a taste of Burbank coming at you from their Magnolia Boulevard headquarters. Here's Brian and John. Hi, it's Brian Ochi. And I'm John David, and this is Magnolia Park News. We created this show to keep our community and our neighbors informed of what's happening in the real estate industry. And not only do we talk about real estate, but we cover current events. We hope the show will be fun and informative. First, I'd like to talk about the perfect storm, and that's what Burbank homeowners are experiencing today. Low inventory, low interest rates, and high demand. It's one of the best times to ever put your house on the market, where we're getting multiple offers like we've never seen before. Thanks, Brian. And right along those lines, according to the Wall Street Journal, the housing market is seeing hopeful signs this spring. After a slow recovery and last year's stall, the sale of previously owned homes was up 4.7% in February compared to last year. Now the spring is a crucial period for sales and it looks like we're getting positive trends for 2015. That must be true, John, because according to The Hill, in February, new home sales hit their highest level in seven years. Things here at home in California also appear to be on the upswing. And according to the California Association of Realtors, they forecast an increase of existing home sales of 5.8%. Solar panels are a great way to go green and effective in saving energy. According to Los Angeles Times, real estate experts in California are saying that solar lease payments are interfering with the sales of homes. Solar panels are great, but make sure you do the research on the long-term leases, both as a buyer and a seller. Water in California has declined so much that a state of emergency has been declared by Governor Brown. So what can we do? What did you know that Burbank Water and Power provides generous incentives to Burbank residences and businesses who remove turf and replace it with drought-tolerant landscape? Residents will receive $3 per square foot and businesses $2 per square foot of turf replaced. For more details, please click on the link down below and always visit magnoliaparknews.com for the latest. We hope to see you at the Burbank Parade. Well, that concludes our first episode. Thanks for watching. And we see some positive trends which point to a busy summer. If you have any questions or concerns or would like to be on our show, please give us a call. If you're thinking about selling and want one of the most powerful marketing tools, please contact us. Media West Realty. Changing the way you look at real estate forever.